Karibu! You are watching Big Minds with me, Shana. Time to join Rishna of Wiggles and Giggles as she helps us learn how to make a puppet. Hi everybody, welcome back today to another episode of DIY and today I'm going to take you on a craft journey to the kitchen. We're going to use a muiko, a wooden cooking spoon to make something really cool. It's called a puppet and to make this muiko puppet, the first thing of course we need is a muiko, a wooden spoon, some yarn or wool, some glue, some scraps of old paper and of course some googly eyes and pipe cleaners. To begin with, you're going to have to first place the eyes of the puppet. So you put some glue for the eyes. Make sure your eyes are leveled. And then I'm going to stick one really big eye and one just the right size. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a mouth. And for the mouth, I'm going to use a pipe cleaner. I'm going to use a red pipe cleaner. And then I'm going to cut some hair. Remember to make sure you ask for help from an adult when you're using a scissor. Okay? And I'm just going to cut some long strands of hair. So my puppet is going to have lots of funny color hair. So I'm even going to cut some green yarn. That's enough for now. <coughs> and I'm going to stick some glue at the edge. Of my puppet. Make sure you've put a generous amount of glue when you're trying to stick the yarn. And it surely looks like I'm going to have to add some. And 
I want to make sure my hair falls behind the puppet. So I'm going to layer some glue at the tip of the wooden spoon. And now I'm going to add the puppet some clothes. And that's why I had some scraps of paper. And I'm going to cut a small triangle nose. And this is my Mr. Rainbow Puppet. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you again next week with another activity. Bye!